Hi guys, welcome back to my channel and happy Monday. For those of you who don't know me, my name is Claudia. In today's video, I'm gonna be getting ready with you guys because I'm gonna be going to work uh, later on. It's barely 10.30, but I wanna have my makeup ready so that way I, I can finish up whatever I need to do around the house. I'll show you guys what I use for uh, my makeup for work and then um, I'm gonna show you guys what I use to make my coffee and that'll be it, okay? So let's get right to it. So to start off, uh, since you guys know I'm gonna be going to work, I have to be wearing a mask so I don't wanna put too much makeup on because I don't wanna start to break out. My face has been really clean lately so I wanna keep it that way. So I'm gonna try to use the least amount of makeup as possible. Keep it very minimum and then all the focus is mainly on the eyes because I am gonna have a mask on. So I'm gonna go ahead and first moisturize my face using the same one Purity Made and Simple Moisturizer by Philosophy. And I'm gonna just go ahead and moisturize. I already washed my hands before this video. And yeah, I'm just gonna go ahead and moisturize because I, since I've been wearing a mask, I tend to get really dry in this area and I want to avoid that and I don't want to break out guys my face has been really good to me my skin I mean has been really good to me so I just want to use the least amount of makeup that I have to and I'm just going to go ahead and now put some of this eye cream which is the Ole Hendrickson one go ahead Apply some some under the eye. So this is the first time in a long time that I have to work this schedule, which is two to what is it, two thirty to eleven. And I don't know. I guess we will see how I feel about it afterwards. I think the last time I worked this schedule was when I was in high school. And well, I guess they're short right now at work, so. I'm like, you know what? I'm just gonna have to do it. I'm gonna have to suck it up even if I don't wanna work that schedule. I have to do it. Cause normally I work the first shift. So that's like what the second shift? The second shift is usually three to 11, but I'm gonna be starting at 2.30. And yeah, that's pretty much it guys. So while that sinks into my skin, I'm gonna start doing my eyebrows, okay? I'm gonna be using a, the Duo by Anastasia Soft Brown, the pommy. This one, I'm gonna be using this spoolie. This is in the 7B, it's also by Anastasia. Um, I'm trying to see if I should do another one. So, I like to do the top part first. So I like to pull the hairs down and then start applying. So hopefully guys, this is the only day I'll have to work at this time. I think the rest of the week I work my normal day schedule, which is first shift. I think tomorrow I start at 8.30 in the morning, so it's not bad. It just feels a little weird because I'm home and then I'm going to be going to work when normally I go to work first, but that's the only thing that's kind of different about it. I just want to look neat, you know, I'm gonna go to work, I don't want to look messy, anything like that. So 
always try to at least do my eyebrows and a little bit of concealer on the face or foundation. Sometimes I use a little bit of bronzer and a little bit of blush. Just don't look so dead. You see the difference? Not into the other eyebrow. Now, I don't always do my eyebrows like this. Sometimes I do it differently, but for today, this is how I'm doing them. I don't have anything planned today just to go to work. Once I get out, obviously it'll be too late already to do pretty much anything. So once I get home, I'll just get, be getting home, shower, and that's it, go to sleep. I already left food ready for tomorrow in case I take lunch. So everything is pretty much set. I just need to get ready. And that'll be all. Next thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna apply some of this clear bra gel. I don't know how I was blowing on as if it was powder. Comb a little bit. Make sure they're the same. Yes, they are. Now, I'm just gonna go ahead and spray my beauty blender. I'm just gonna dab. Just so that I don't apply too much. Like I said, I don't want to have a lot on my face. That is it for foundation. Next thing is my concealer. Apply under the eyes.
now we're gonna put on our powder. I still have time. Probably make myself a sandwich to take with me. I might not even get hungry to be honest. Or I might eat before I leave. I know I'll still get a lunch break, but I know I'm not even gonna be hungry. Now I'm going to just apply um, a little bit of eyeshadow on my crease. But you know, I'm just gonna use the bronzer that I normally use. This is the Too Faced Milk Chocolate Soleil. I'm gonna apply a little bit on the crease just so that it looks like I have some type of shadow going on. Just on the crease. Now I don't look so pale. No, I don't always do this step, but I have time right now, so I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna just do it. If I have fallout, I just clean it off because it's not a dark color either way. And then I'm gonna use the other end of the brush to put some underneath. And then I'm gonna use that same bronzer to bronze my entradas, my widow's peak. Just because I have a really deep widow's peak. So I don't want it to stand out a lot, but. I wasn't going to apply any to my cheeks, but since I already put some on the, where my widow's peak is, I'm going to have to apply some on my cheeks. In the end, this is going to come off when I have the mask on. Next thing I'm gonna do, I'm gonna curl my eyelashes.
this into the other side. I'm just gonna apply some to the bottom lashes. Oh, let me get this mark right there. Perfect. Lastly, I like to apply some lip balm because, like I said, I don't have a mask on, but I don't want my lips to get dry. I'm just gonna dab a little bit of this one. This one is in the this by Maybelline, and it's the baby baby lips, and it's in the color I don't know what color this is, but it's the only red one that they sell. And it doesn't really come out red; but it just gives your lips some color and moisture. And then I'm just gonna go ahead and spray some some fix plus. And I'm gonna just put this away. You guys probably hate that I do that, but I don't want to lose the out. And I'm gonna be showing you guys how to make my coffee. So some fix plus so clean. I'm just very subtle okay so I'm gonna bring you guys with me we're gonna go um, to the kitchen it's right out here and then that way I can show you guys how I make my coffee So I'm gonna set you guys down here. I know you guys can't really see my face, but I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hands. Since I was, um, you know, applying makeup, I'm gonna go ahead and wash my hands really quick. So, I normally like to use um, a mug or whatever coffee cup I'm gonna be taking with me, but since today I work at a weird time, I'm not gonna take the coffee with me. I'm just gonna go ahead and drink it before I leave. Also because once I get there, I'm gonna be taking temperatures in the emergency, um, an emergency exit. So I don't wanna be touching stuff. I don't wanna have my cup there or anything. So I'm just gonna be using a regular cup and I hope you guys can see. And then I'm gonna first uh, put some ice in my cup. Oh, shit. Oh, 
rice came out. Okay, and then, guys. so this is a coffee I like to use. I've been loving it. It is unsweet black coffee. You can find this at Target. I'm gonna go ahead and put some in my cup. Just like so, not the way out to, not the way, all the way up to the top, so I could put some creamer. And then this one is the creamer caramel macchiato. This one right here. It's uh, the star. It says Starbucks caramel, and it says you can also find it at Target. They might not have it at Target because everybody's been going crazy um, buying this stuff. So you can just probably find it at Jules. That's where I found it the last time. And I'm just gonna go ahead and pour it in here. But before I keep applying, uh, pouring more in there, I said applying. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and mix it. Just so that you know if you want it darker or if that's good enough. See, I put too much. You already tell. Let me try it. Oh, actually, I did not. It's literally perfect. And that's it, guys. This is what it looks like. I know you guys are probably thinking like I have my coffee machine right here but I rarely use it I'm not gonna lie um, there's no reason for it it's just I don't know we well, start using it in the beginning but then I came across this coffee and I really like this one we'll probably go back to using it it's not like we're never gonna use it but for now you guys need to try this combination it's delicious and that's it guys I'm just gonna finish getting ready to leave in a little while and that's it. I hope to see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.